Oi, oi. Taking a shower never felt so good. Oh my gosh. Oh. Mm. Boy. And I mainly say that because the uh, the pipes froze, but I do not believe that they broke, which is good. It's very good. And that's with, you know, doing all necessary uh, preparations and precautions. Sometimes they still do. Oh, man. Feels so good. Feels so good to be clean. <laughs> oh, man. <clears throat> you know what I think about sometimes? <laughs> Is it like Simba fucking... He sang, right? He was like, I can't wait to be king. And then it went from, I can't wait to be king, to, Father, no! <laughs> Father, help! Oh no, my boy! And I was just like, hmm. Are you really grieving now? I mean, you really wanted to be king. Now you want to sing. Fucking... <laughs> But no, it, it was the sad part. I love the Lion King. <clears throat> Which actually, since we're uh, here to chit-chat and talk about cool things and relax and, well, be chill. Um, <laughs> <clears throat> well, I had, right, well, I had an original copy of Lion King. VHS, and I'm like, oh, baby, I gotta snatch that shit up, yeah, because she was gonna get, she was getting rid of a whole bunch of, like, DVDs and stuff like that, <clears throat> and I think, like, she had the, the DVD version of the original Dune, like, you know, a, a, a re-release DVD style for the, the new generation of technology, and I was like, okay, well, I'm getting that, the original Toy Story, original Lion King, and I'm just like, <laughs> Oh, yeah, baby. <clears throat> Even though I don't have um, a VHS player. But my Xbox does double as a DVD player. So if I wanted to watch Dune, I would. I'm on a much nicer TV than I've ever had before. I'm actually kind of surprised that I got this TV for the price that I did at, uh, I think, Target? Walmart? No, it was definitely Target. And this was years back years back, by the way, so, you know, but I'm, I'm very happy with it, I'm very happy, <clears throat> that's back whenever I was making motherfucking bank, working at that shitty ass, uh, <laughs> <clears throat> shitty ass warehouse, oh, I miss the pay, but I definitely do not miss the people, and the work was okay, except uh, it started getting to a point where they didn't know how to fucking keep shit together. And then it affected my ability to work smoothly, and that pissed me off in its own way. Because it was like, you know, I, I'm, I'm just fucking doing this shit going ham. And then, of course, I started getting bored, because I couldn't just, you know, <clears throat> go ham in the paint. And yeah, it just, it was the downhill slope. But y'all already know that story. About their shitty fucking CVS warehouse. That I don't ever have to be around again. And that makes me very happy. Fuck that place, how it runs the fuck down. Uh, you know, in fact, I hope that <clears throat> CVS goes out of business. But not just goes out of business and then gets bought up and, like, rebranded or whatever. Like, CVS Plus or whatever. No, I hope that entire fucking thing just, you know, dies. <laughs> Non-revival, non-re-resourced. Uh, other companies just came in, just come in, swoop, take all their shit for themselves, and then CBS is dead. Yes, it was that bad. To warrant that much hate. Ugh. 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 But now that it's not 20 degrees anymore, ugh. I don't have to worry about icy roads. <sighs> good stretches are good. <sighs> I'm excited. I'm genuinely excited to be clean. <laughs> uh, fuck. I don't mind getting dirty. Obviously, I mean, shit. I worked on a. Uh, I worked on a classic car for almost three years. Uh, getting covered in all that grease and dust and all that shit. I don't have a problem getting dirty. 
what I have a problem with is staying dirty. That, that is an issue. Okay. Mm -mm. <laughs> ah, fam. <clears throat> but an issue no longer. <laughs> you know, it is going to be nice to, <clears throat> to go to Alton's again. Although, it's weird though, he hasn't messaged me back for a bit. A little concerned. I mean, he's healthy. Like, he's in his 60s, but he's, he's fucking healthy, you know? Like, <laughs> dude can outpace 20-year-olds with ease. Keep right on up with him. I mean, shit, dude. Dude is a... <laughs> dude's a fucking beast, man. So, I don't know. Although, because he does fuck around with heavy equipment and stuff like that, it is very likely <clears throat> that he may have accidentally dropped or misplaced his phone and then uh, subsequently got it crushed to bits. To pieces, you say? No, wait, wait, is it to pieces or to bits? No, yeah. Oh, no, to shreds, you say? Ooh, that's what it was. That's what it was, to shreds. Fucking love Futurama. So that's probably all it is. Either that or <clears throat> he was doing a lot of repairing for the uh, <clears throat> the two women that he takes care of. And, uh, you know, does like property stuff for. That might be it. <clears throat> I mean, Corbin definitely would have said something if like, you know, he broke his leg or some shit. And he did not. <sighs> <sighs> Oh. <laughs> it's a good day to relax. It is indeed. It is indeed. And it will be for me after I uh, after I finish recording all this stuff that I'm going to be recording. The be recording. I noticed that I missed a word there. Why use many word when a few word do trick, huh? <laughs> I fucking love the office. <clears throat> but yes, I've got this, Instagram and TikTok, which are kind of one and the same. I can use the same uh, thingamajig, can use the same content, so it's two things. <clears throat> then a couple of commissions. Uh, maybe the hub, I believe. Yeah, the hub will probably get one. Although as slow as they are to process, uh, it might be tomorrow. Or, you know, might get lucky, and even though I finish it today, it'll actually get posted today, potentially. <clears throat> Man. <sighs> you know, if I had an easier time sleeping, I probably would give it a try to just, you know... <laughs> Let my phone record me sleeping. And just, you know, the sounds of me moving around a bit or potentially snoring to help folks fall asleep. But I already get, you know, it's already difficult enough. And then <clears throat> I'll be distracted by the fact that uh, I know that I'm trying to do a thing. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, yeah. Well, it's all right. I'll come up with uh, other ideas for uh, for things like that. <laughs> yeah, I don't know if you guys heard that, but I'm pretty sure that was either a Camaro or Challenger, I believe. Maybe a Charger. Motherfuckers happy that the roads ain't froze no more, so now they get to fuck around. Remember, Texas is a huge car scene. Texas is a massive car scene. So don't forget that. And I'm talking about from fucking Lambos and Porsche 911s to fucking... <clears throat> 70s fucking Camaros and shit like that, dude. Dropped and lifted trucks. All kinds of stuff. All kinds of heavily modified vehicles. Motorcycles. If it has wheels, you can guarantee that they'll fuck with it. <laughs> uh.
It's pretty nice being a part of it. I mean, <clears throat> even though I'm not a part of any clubs because I just I don't like to be, you know, I don't want to be a part of any kind of car club or motor enthusiast, whatever. Like to go down to a, <clears throat> a car show in Dusty would be cool, but uh, <laughs> yeah, as far as as far as like being an actual part of any group, uh, nah, nah, because I like doing things on my own time, right? So it's just like being in a in a clan in a game. We're like, oh yeah, we're gonna have this meeting. We're like, it's a video game, bro. Chill the fuck out. It's not that serious. But you know, like like shit like that. I just, I mean, I don't want to be. There. I already, I already have a job career. You know, I don't need a second one. When I come by, see the signs, have my fun, uh, 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 talk the little car shit that I know. And listen a hell of a lot more, so that way I can learn more. Uh, and maybe get the down low on where to get badass parts without, you know, eviscerating my bank. Whenever I'm able to get back into it. Ow. But there are far more important things that I need to get underway. Like getting an agent. And advertising my content. I think, I think actually YouTube does have like a proper thing where they actually just, uh, slap a sponsor tag. Or sponsored. <laughs> uh, tag on the bottom left hand corner of your video. <clears throat> and they actually play your video as an ad, I believe. So, if that's the case, and it's not like that bullshit that TikTok and Instagram do... Or it's all like, oh, yeah, yeah, promote your shit, promote your shit. And then it's just a bunch of bots, you know, interacting with your shit. And you don't actually get any notoriety. Shit, I might actually do that. Because I remember seeing it before. And then I saw something like it recently. Right? And so I'm just like, well, well, well. Maybe that's a good idea. Yeah, yeah. At least until I can afford an agent, you know. I think that would be a good idea. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the crusty crab pizza is for you and me. <laughs> <sighs> I ate a whole can of peas today for breakfast, by the way. <laughs> Just now thinking about it, it does seem kind of like an odd breakfast, right? So I had the, the full can of beans, or peas. Full. The entire can of peas. And then I had some beans to go with it. And then I had, uh... <clears throat> chicken. Mixed with some eggs. And... There were some onions in there. Was that all I had? I think, yeah. Yeah, yeah, okay, that, that's what I had, yeah. The beans. And it was only a little bit of beans. And then a full can of peas and some chicken and eggs. Which, I mean, hey... You know, healthy. Great protein. You know, getting some veg in there, too. Probably a bit excessive on the peas, but, uh... <laughs> yeah. Peas for breakfast. Give it a try. <laughs> uh, I'm very tired. <laughs> And I'm hoping to help you get tired, so that way you can have an easier time sleeping. Because as long as one of us is, then that's a net win. And it's, it's a good thing. <laughs> uh, I wonder if anybody remembers that. I don't, I don't remember what her name is, but she used to cook. Right, she had, she had a cooking show in the 80s and 90s, I believe. So, yeah, yeah. I can't remember her name, but she, she fucking got down. She got down in the kitchen just whipping up a whole bunch of shit. And I can't remember her fucking name, but uh, she was so pleasant and... Which is whipping up a storm. 
like I said, but I just, I can't remember her name. I'm pretty sure that Dad remembers. Because I believe he watched it. Yeah, I don't know. If y'all know who I'm talking about, let me know. Because I actually don't think that I've ever met anybody who remembers that chef. She was an older lady. I think she actually started the TV show, uh, maybe in her fi- Oh, excuse me, 50s or 60s, so... Hmm. Yeah, let me know. Let me know. I'm gonna go ahead and record all the rest of the stuff, y'all. Have a good day or evening. And hopefully, you'll be able to fall asleep soon. And either have no dreams, or only the sweetest of ones. Wait, did you hear that? I thought I heard some thunder. I didn't see any lightning. Ka-chow! There it is. <laughs>